Hello, we're in Global Source Show in Hong Kong and now we're in a Plata booth. Last April, we visited this booth uh, for a few of the mini PC and this time they still show some new models. We introduced KB1 in April and this time we, ha we can see that they make the family design for this mo these two models. Now let's have a look at KB1 first. As we can see, they have a right red frame at the front and uh, some blue pattern on the top. So it should be a very nice design and also if you uh, want to make your own brand, maybe they can help you to change the design at the top. This box uh, is around 11 uh, centimeters by 12 centimeters and the thickness comes around 4.3 centimeters it weighs like uh, around 950 grams as you can see from at the front we can we have a power button one audio jack one usb-c and two usb-3 on the side we have a slot for micro sd at the back we have a um, power, two HDMI out, two more USB 3 and one Ethernet port. Uh, at the bottom we have a grill design for the ventilation. At the back we can see the fan designed and also two holes for vessel mount. Now let's open the box and have a look inside. Uh, at the back of the cover, we have a 2.5 inch HDD and here there's a um, M.2280 SSD and on, the, on this side we have memory slots. Now let's move on to the uh, specifications. It supports KB Lake R and from i3, i5 to i7 and the memory supports DDR4 also uh, two memory slots the storage as we mentioned it supports SSD and also HDD for the system it supports Windows 10 or Linux now we are going to show you another amazing uh, mini PC. It's just a um, PCBA, but we are expecting uh, later in one or two months for this product. It is the first ever uh, Whiskey Lake mini PC we're going to see in the market. Actually, they are going to use the exactly, exactly the same chassis as KB1, so we can see from the ports. But um, the difference between these two models uh, will be uh, whiskey whiskey lake ports. They they do not have a, a memory slot on the side but um, they will have soldered uh, memory at the back. Now let's have a look at the specifications. The PCBA support uh, Whiskey Lake from i3, i5 to i7 and the memory supports LPDDR4 and it will come with 4 GB, 8 GB and 16 GB. The storage will be EMMC from 32 GB to 128 GB. Also, they will support HDD or SSD. Okay. The system will be Windows 10 or Linux. Okay. 
now let's have a look at our the last new model that we're going to see in the in the show it's called gb9 as we can see it is much slimmer than kb1 we have seen before as the thickness is around three centimeters but the design is a slightly bigger than kb1 so have a look at the design at the front we have a um, power button at the right hand side we have a three usb three ports one um, for power at the back we have a one usb three sorry usb c two hdmi out and two ports for ethernet and also one audio jack um, on the other side uh, we, we uh, these are for the ventilation have a look at the button uh, there's no fan as we can see but they have we can see from here uh, they have an option for HDD now have a look at the specifications this mini PC comes with a Gemini Lake and uh, it supports from N4000 up to J4105 and the weight is around 750 gram the memory supports LPDDR4 from 4 gigabytes to 8 gigabytes the storage supports EMMC from 32 gigabytes to 128 gigabytes also they support HDD or SSD the wing sorry, the, the system supports Windows 10 or Linux now we are excited to know that the KB1 is already on the market but we still need to wait around uh, one at the end of month for the mass production of GB9 for the latest model with a uh, whiskey lake um, according to the company we still need to wait around one month for next production so let's stay tuned thank you